Hello and welcome to Spoon TV. We bring you updates from outside the legislature um, while some of our colleagues are in. Marcel is in bringing updates. We also have an array of lawmakers who's been led by Marvin Kuo, Representative Marvin Kuo, and they are currently moving in to where others are. As you can see, he's being supported by um, other supporters, support staff, and other array of lawmakers who have gathered and uh, like a reinforcement to um his quest so as you can see from the outside of the capitol building from the legislature this is what is happening staff are all outside there's um we will say no good working day to day here at the legislature so this is spoon tv my name is dennis nipson and we bring you update as you unfold inside and we are outside the capitol building bringing you update currently representative marvin co is moving in he came out to uh, with other lawmakers to join him and currently they have come and they are all moving in to the joint chambers where all other lawmakers are gathered So they have used to be um, a disrupted day at the legislature due to um, what is unfolding to um, remove the speaker. So currently they are all moving in and we are out here bringing you happiness of what is unfolding. Currently, you have staff us all standing by just in their separate um, segments discussing what is unfolding. Now uh, you have um, Edward Papi Flomo, Edward Papi Flomo, who is also joining the others. So currently, as it relates to the Liberal National Police, um, as you can see, we have three officers who are here currently on ground. There are some um, reports of another um, to join them, but it has not yet been established. 
but currently there's three officers on the ground and I think making sure that nothing goes out of control. Now we see the arrival of the riot police who are here currently and are engaging. So yes, the riot police have come with reinforcement. So currently we are aware that lawmakers are held hostage. Are held hostage. So um, they've been brief and I think um, to carry on their operation and as we have learned that the police have come to ensure that those who are in the John chambers can be removed because currently there's news of about the chambers being locked and some lawmakers are finding it difficult to come out and even their staff also are there supporting them this is Spoon TV shared a video invite someone to watch we are currently at the legislature prepared or in the uh, riot so they've been briefed by the head of the zone So as you can see, um, the riot police of the Liberal National Police are all moving in. This is the Capitol building and to put the control as you can see. So they've been escorted by their heads and they are ensuring that they can move in the building. And like it has been said, the image to to this lodge, all of those who are in the building in the John's chamber. So this is Spoon TV.
So currently there's breathing on going because um to enter the building, I think the shoe that should be strategically done. So currently they've been briefed by their heads and how to engage the process. Because as you learn and you have been watching Spoon TV, there's a lot of people in the junk chambers. So um, getting in will be a strategy that the police can enforce to ensure that those who are in the building can be put out of the, that is the junk chambers. <laughs> Welcome to Spoon TV. We are here live at the legislature where um following today's incident with some lawmakers um making effort to remove the speaker, Speaker Fonati Kofa. So there have been altercation between those lawmakers and staffers who are supporting or who are against. Um, they are all assembled in the junk chambers and it is congested and there's, um, there are some who have locked the door as well, preventing others from leaving the junk chambers. So currently there's um, backup from the Liberian National Police, um, the riot police that have come to ensure that there can be rules and order here at the legislature. My name is Dennis Lipsy. Share the video, and this is Spoon TV live from the legislature. So some of lawmakers are now relieving. They are now the lawmakers are now coming out of the chambers, the junk chambers, as you can see. Yeah. So they are all leaving from the chambers. So um, I think they needed um, this thing. This is Rachel Kuhn, who is leading the the group that is intending to remove the speaker. So as you can see. So we are making efforts. Uh, Honorable Kuhn, welcome to Spoon. Okay. Yeah, yeah, so so they are about to read the, the resolution. So as you heard from Honorable Rachel Kuhn, um, they are all guarding here to read um, the resolution. The resolution that will give rights to their uh, quest to impeach um, the speaker, to remove the speaker. So, as you can see, um, the lawmakers who are performing this quest are all coming out currently. 
and this is what parental they want to read a resolution and you have those who are are against this um also Mavico also is coming out with his own group who are not in support of this So I'm here, I'm being joined by Chokon. Chokon, currently we are here and you see opposing uh, sides at the legislature here. What do you make of that, Chokon? As we await the resolution according to the chairman, the leader, Honorable Richard Kuhn, of those who are opting to remove the speaker, he said that in a moment for now, they will be reading this resolution. We can, we can go closer to see what, what resolution they're going to be reading. We, and they are in their normal school. Yes. Because they are yes. in their normal school. This is legislative politics. Normal matters a lot. A lot. So what we see here. Yes. <laughs> We don't know what the outcome will be, might but, be. But you can see the number. Yes, a lawmaker who have come. So you can yeah, see yeah, also yeah, the supporters yeah, of, yeah, of yeah. the speaker, the speaker. Yes, and they are all chanting "roll, roll, roll, roll." Uh, yes, um, and we hope to see what this. What's on food? So it's a very, very much dramatic scene. Dramatic scene. Yes. Legislature. Yes. You're going to use the man. You got to use it also. Anyone up there to play the play? Just that. Just that. Just that. Just that. So they are moving to uh, another venue where, according to them, the resolution can be read because um, they are not given a chance to to read the resolution. So clashes between the supporters. Fabula is saying that um, Melvico is distracting their movement. So that the so the supporters that will kill So this is a serious situation here. Aji. Yeah. <laughs> 
So this is Spoon TV. We are here and we we have a full team coverage here at the legislature. So we are bringing you play by play coverage here at the legislature. So, um, Richard Poon and the others. Okay, we are still in front of you. We were on a thread this morning. We picked up your bosses. They said that you will come to the bank. We are here now. We are here now. Why is it that we be a top and uh, we see you standing in this room? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You stupid! Why you push me? Come back! Why you push me? Come back! Come on! 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 Come um, what we are spent on the market this morning is that uh, our colleagues, our people, a couple of our colleagues moved in, disrupting our activities, locking our doors, our joint chamber, our locker. So we decided to actually to get around. And I think one part for me, because the first step we have to be taken, we've led to here. Now you are here. We don't want to see ourselves going to some camp. So, the group of lawmakers um, said that the one speaker um, for the people of our room. We have the number that's 49 after our constitution, and that's where we are now. So we move to our joint chamber. We have our, our, our other chamber. They have the right to go there. So we in the joint chamber, we're all, 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 we're
So, with your presence, we just want to know when do you move in with the other situation and then we will move out of Let me say something. I know that a rebel in time no, 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 hold on, hold on, I'll call you to honor. No, 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 I didn't call you rebel. I didn't call you rebel. I didn't call you rebel. We are not engaged with anything. If anything that goes to your plea, you will arrest it and put it under control. That's why we are here. Wait, I will see that. We are not giving up. 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 So you had uh, Representative Marvin Co and Representative Gligiard who were um, discussing with the officer and according to Gligiard who are those lawmakers that want to, um, they are opting to remove the speaker, they are asking for protection um, to carry on their fortune. So but Representative Marvin Co, the group that is is showing that they don't um, achieve their quest is saying that there will be no none of such because they are proceeding illegally to remove a legitimate um, speaker
So currently it is actually difficult for those who opt in to remove the speaker to read their resolution because um the supporters, supporter lawmakers or those lawmakers who are against the removal of the speaker are preventing them from having an easy route in terms of reading their resolution that is opting or that will ensure the removal of the speaker. So it's kind of difficult now for them. So at first uh, they had a decision to move out of the legislature, but they have agreed to remain and stay around the flagpole of the legislature to read the resolution. So um, they are now preparing to read a resolution. As you can see, you have um, Representative Poon who is leading the charge along with the other lawmakers who are here and they are trying, they are getting prepared to read out the resolution. So if you are just joining, this is Spoon TV here at the Capitol building, the legislature, where some lawmakers um, are opting to remove Speaker Fonati Kofa, and you have the others who are opposing their quest to remove um, the Speaker. And currently, there's a resolution to be read that will give premise to the removal or the impeachment of the Speaker. So this is why they are all gathered here and trying to see how they can read that resolution. Earlier on, there, there was disruption from the opposing side that such won't happen. So they are now setting up to read the resolution.
And so the same business will be conducted outside of the chimos, the, the, the main chimos, and also outside of the adjunct uh, chimos, because uh, uh, from the other side, and the step in, and the step in, 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 Yeah, So currently they are making effort to ensure that all others who are opting for this removal can come to, can come over so that the So one may say this is legislative politics at the moment and it's about who becomes um, success, successful in their quest. So um, Marvin Cole and his team doing everything possible to ensure that this does not, you know, happen. So currently, that's 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 what I'm holding here at the legislature. Mm -hmm. 